In today's video, we will see how you can install an MQTT software on your Windows machine. So let's get started. In my previous video, if you recall, we installed a Mosquito broker on the local machine. And the way we tested that was we went into the CMD, we went into where it was installed, which is program files and then um, Mosquito, there's a folder and I open the same over here just to recap it program files and then mosquito and then on the one on one tab we uh, publish and on the other tab we subscribe so over here I will just subscribe with the topic which is nothing but first test so I've subscribed over here and over here what I'll do is mosquito pub hyphen topic which is first test and then message is testing the local mqtt broker so this is just basically the recap what i'll do is i will press enter over here and it should be seen over here now to use that it's it's a little complicated because you won't open uh the command prompt all the time go back back and forth subscribe so what would be a better way of doing that so we can use an application so what i'll do is i will go to microsoft store it's very simple you go to microsoft store and you type mqtt once you type you'll get bunch of softwares right which one to use and which one is good enough so I would suggest MQTT box, which is a very good software. I've already installed it. If you have not, uh, you'll have to probably log in into your uh, Microsoft account and then install it. And once you install it, it will give you an option directly to open it. So what I'll do is I will just open it. So once you open it, this is the window you will see. Now you can create a new client. That is what you have to do. Now the mosquito is already installed in your local machine. So all you have to do is I will just give a name over here, personal broker, personal MQTT broker. Uh, you'll have to select the protocol of MQTT TCP. And then this is an important thing host. So what will be the host now, since it's a mosquito one, so it will be test dot mos keto.org and then we don't have any username or password defined so all we can do is save uh, if all the details are correct it will connect over here if it is not it will give you an error now how you can test it so I will subscribe on the same topic over here I will use this one where I published something testing the MQ local MQTT application so what it will basically do is it will first test it will publish over here right and then you can use the same thing over here first test and you can have the same welcome to test the application so we have subscribed to the same one it will publish as well and then this is independent of that but that means whatever you do in this software is still open and it is still connected with the MQTT broker that we are using so this is how you can install the software test it out and validate it then you can just close it you don't even have to have this open and then application one and then you publish it it's active so even if the command prompt is closed the mosquito broker on your local machine is active that's all for now if you have any doubts you can ask me uh, any questions in the comment sections below i hope you like the like this video and understood what i went through uh, till then like my video share it with your friends and subscribe my channel thank you